The new Zerion tractor, we, we launched fully into the market last year. This is our second full year. with it. We've had pre-series uh, in North America prior to that. Um, in Europe, Zerion has been, has been in Europe in one form or another. Of course, we have many updates over the years uh, since the, the, the late 90s. Uh, and it was designed, it's built for us, it, it's built for North America in Harsfinkel, Germany at our main headquarters there. Uh, and it's designed with a lot of European applications in mind. But when we brought it to North America, the first thing is we needed tier four final in the engine. So this has a, a new Mercedes 12.8 uh, liter, fully SCR tier four compliant. And then we've also ha had them change a lot of things for North America, like duals. In Europe, they don't use that because of the width of their roads and things. We've also had them change the cab entry. I've had them change the hydraulics for our large air seaters and our, and our dual priority flows. Uh, made a lot of changes to make it more unique and applicable for North America, including changes in the three-point hitch and actually a quick connector that we use here. So. Um, with that, we're seeing a lot of applications with Zerion. Yeah, it can be a drawbar tractor, it can pull a disc and a, and a chisel plow and those kind of things, but it does very well in air seeder markets for our Western Canadian and Northern Plains markets. It also does extremely well in manure handling, slurry and, and compost spreading because it has a 30 mile an hour road speed. All right. The other thing is uh, it works very well in pit packing and forage applications because uh, I don't know if you can tell or not, but this is not a standard articulate tractor. It's four wheel steer, which means we can also crab steer so that the that when you do put it into crab steer and you're packing, you get overlap of the tires and there's no space in between the duels that doesn't get compacted. You know, it's all about consistency of pack and this one gives you that so we can crab steer and do that. Other great features of it is it's a full CVT transmission. The only one in the market at 530 horsepower with a full CVT. So that's saving you fuel, ease of consistency, uh, consistency in, in speed and efficiency all the way through. It's a very smooth transmission and it works great when you've got large piles in front of you. You just buck up to it with, with a large blade and just push on through. So it's very highly productive. Um, you know, Zerion isn't for everybody, but if you have an application where you need multiple um, features to hit specific niches that other standard articulate tractors can't, Zerion's the answer. The reaction from, from the, the customers that we've got them out at, they love it. Um, the, because it is so unique in what it can do and the, and the efficiencies of time and fuel uh, is incomparable. And these guys are reporting back to us that they're seeing savings in various applications, anywhere from 5 to 25% in fuel, that they're working anywhere from, from 10 to 15% more as far as acres covered or tons pushed, and that's the main things. In the cab, you can see you've got excellent visibility in all directions, all the way around 360 degrees. And we use the, the Lexion style steering wheel, so it, it tilts up out of your way complete with tilt and telescope seat swivels, but up here, everything you need is all right there at your hand. This entire lever here, I can control my forward speed, I can control my shuttle, I can control my constant ground speed control, I can control up to four different remotes, all off of that one handle, so my hand never has to move. Even if I have, say in, in the case of a, of a push pack application, I have a six-way blade. I can control all of the blade, all of the shuttle, all of the speed without ever taking my hand off of this handle. As far as all of your monitoring, control uh, settings, it's all done through Cebus, which is our uh, Kloss onboard electrical information system. Mm -hmm. um, even the hydraulic reversing fan is done with just the push of a button right, <clears throat> right on the console. <coughs> so it is an extremely comfortable tractor, great visibility, it's very very quiet because uh, again all of our exhaust is down there to the side, it's not right here uh, in the glass area where it uh, resonates. So it is a very comfortable easy tractor to uh, drive. And with a CVT at the hardest part, just to get it moving, there's a pedal on the floor. It works just like the gas pedal in an automatic pickup truck. Mm -hmm. Just push on the gas pedal. The more you push it, the faster you go, you let off of it, you slow down. The main features of the Zerion is, of course, Tier 4 Final Compliance. Here we can see all of our SCR and our dosing module. We don't have any large exhaust uh, 
uh, pipes or intake pipes. Many of our competitors have something that's equivalent to a 55-gallon drum that's right in the front corner of the of the cab. Impedes visibility, and it's harder to service. Here, everything's ground level, very easy to get at. So that's all designed as an integral part and not something that's just been added on later. It's been designed in from the, the very beginning. Uh, we also buckle that Mercedes-Benz engine up with a CVT transmission. CVT transmission all the way up to 31 miles per hour uh, gives you excellent control, excellent speed choices. Underneath are updated heavy-duty axles with triple compound planetaries at the end so that we can take the higher horsepower loads and the higher torque loads with the duals. As far as uh, interface, we have a front three-point hitch option. Not a lot of use for it, but if you couple that with a turning cab option, which is very unique as an option, this entire cab can lift up, rotate 180 degrees, and sit back down over the rear axle. So now you can work in reverse position, and you can also have a three-point hitch at the other end. So if you're putting a blade on the three-point hitch with a packer roller on the rear, if you're doing snow blowing up in the northern uh, regions, uh, or if you're doing forestry work, it works very well for that. So back here, we've updated the entire three-point hitch area and gone to a North American quick coupler style. We've also updated hydraulics so that we not only have a single priority like many of our competitors do, but we also have a second, we also have a second pump uh, that will run a separate air seeder. So those guys that are doing a double shoot air seeder, they can easily tie in their hydraulics and lock in their fan speeds or the population rates, uh, and it works very, very well for that. We also have a third option for hydraulics that can get them up to over 118 gallons per minute uh, and give you actually three priorities at that point in time. So you've got plenty of, of, of uh, power there. We've also had them update the drawbars. This is our standard drawbar. It takes about a 7,000 pound load capacity. But you know, with today's large grain carts, large slurry wagons, large tow in between uh, uh, air tanks, we get a lot more weight. We, we actually have one guy that's using this with a 48 row corn planter, a DB120 bar, that when it's folded up puts 17,000 pounds of load on a drawbar. So the heavy duty option that we have available can take up to 23,000 pounds of vertical load capacity. That's over twice of what many of our competitors have in their heavy duty versions. We have three model options. One is the Zerian 4000, then the Zerian 4500, and the Zerian 5000. Basically, as horsepowers go, let's call them rough numbers. Four and a quarter, four and three quarter, and five and a quarter.